I feel like God, I'm a cogget. Whoa, busting my ass, I know all things. Whoa, me, I've been working, I grind from the ground, and now you see my dripping so cogget. Uh, cogget, cogget. No tell me, you saw me. Never had breaks, no off days. Bitch, my drip, ho. Look. I'm a legend, but spell on my presence, don't touch me, I'm ready, my drip like Hokage, see you and I, we both had nothing in common, I move like Kakashi, I do shit to bro. What, what's up guys, it's your boy Top the Boss, back with another video for y'all today, and today we're going to be checking out this God of High School game, again made by Mezumi Studios, you probably saw my video on the game Project Kaizen, yeah, I did a video on that game basically, and it was a pretty cool game. It also made by Mesami Studios. I see it did very, very well. So we're gonna go back to Mesami Studios and we're gonna be checking out their God of High School game. Um, if you haven't already, make sure to like and subscribe, okay? Like and subscribe so God of High School gets a good season two because man, that God of High School season one was, you know, I've, I've been reading the God of High School web too. Look. Look, let me let me pull up right here. Like, I've I've been reading a God of High School Red too, and that that stuff is hype. So yeah, make sure to like and subscribe so God of High School gets a good season too. Check out my face reveal video um, and why I got banned on Roblox. Um, that that's pretty interesting. It's got a good amount of views. I've got a new intro and I've got I've got this video of how to make Roblox thumbnails. But they're pretty good videos, so yeah, yeah. Just make sure you like and subscribe. And also, if you want to keep up with all my videos and all my tweets, join my Discord link. Link is in the description below. And also, if you like Hunter Hunter, you can join my Hunter Hunter game. Link will also be in the description below. And yeah, let's start the video. Alright, so we're in um, Mezumi Studios and we're in their God of High School sneaks. And I've moved up to their first sneak. Now, here the game's called Project Chariot. And we're already at their first sneak and now this looks so clean like I, i've modeled before but this model looks so clean um but i just it's weird it do, you don't know how they're going to implement it because it looks 2d but the, the 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 model just looks so clean like whoever made this bruh like your model looks so clean we got loads of sneaks to get through so we're just gonna fly through this honestly but this game sneaks are clean i think this is in the pose in the pose i don't i don't know what to say how to say his name but the nine tails fox dude from god of high school this is his um chariot no no not his chariot his fighting style so yeah that's pretty cool i'll give that a solid sneak like a nine out of ten then we've got a, then we got a gfx they didn't need to do all of this scribbling like they could have just they could have just done a small watermark but Okay, I can't really see it because they've scribbled all over it, but still, still, both of these GFX look clean. It's just hands hair is weird here. But still, I'd probably give this an 8 out of 10, and this is a 7 out of 10. Both their GFX are quite cool. First one's a thumbnail, but it looks better than the icon lock. Oh, yeah, this, this is the game icon, and here's the game thumbnail. Next, we've got Mirrors National Treasure. Um, Moonlight Sword, that I have no idea how it turned into a national treasure, but it is what it is. Like, the God of High School anime was very confusing. Like, one minute we went from fighting in a tournament, okay, a tournament of actual fighting, then to go and fighting a cult to save the world from a key or whatever was going on. Honestly, I, I have no idea. But yeah, this sneak looks solid. Like, it, it look, the sword looks really good. I'll give this an 8 out of 10. Just because the sword's not that interesting. Um, what else do we have? Can I add reactions? No. Shockwave. Shockwave looks decent. I'll give that a 6 out of 10. Now, Mirror's. Mirror's sword. That looks solid as well. Like, the sword and then the little thing hanging off of it. I can't really see it closer, but it still looks good. Oh, here we've got, uh, we've got a little particle animation. I'll give this an 8 out of 10. That's really solid. Particle animation, give it a 6, it looks sick. But still, now we come on to the chariots. Now, Q, Q and um, R, I think are my favourite judges. Or maybe the black judge, like she has an interesting chariot. All the judges are really interesting, except the, the red haired one and the blue haired one. Like, all of the judges are really interesting, especially in the webtoon. I suggest you go read the webtoon if you like go to high school, because Free on the webtoon website so it's, it's pretty it's pretty cool but 
Judge Q and the black judge have the coolest chariots. Um, the blonde head judge, Judge R. Um, I don't, I haven't seen his chariot yet, but he's a pretty cool character overall. But yeah, he has a pretty, he has a cool chariot. So I'm gonna have to give this sneak like honestly a nine out of ten. Like this is the best chariot I've seen. One of the best models I've seen on Roblox. It just looks so clean, and like the the style, like the the group, what's it called, the texture on it. It just looks. I don't I don't know how to describe it. It just looks clean though. So I'm gonna have to give that a solid nine out of ten. Maybe even a 10 out of 10, but nah, I'll, I'll give it a 9. Now here, finally, it didn't scribble over it, but still, okay, this, this looks a lot better, like, this definitely looks a lot better. Yeah, I, I'd give, yeah, I'd give both of these, I'd give this um, an 8 out of 10, and that raises this to a 7 out of 10, because now it looks a lot better. Now I've added the scythe, I, I have to make this a 9.5, like, the scythe, it looks so clean, bro. Honestly, this game, this game is definitely an under, well, not really underrated because they've got 3k members, but still, they put a lot of hard work into their games. So, on Roblox, the chariot looks pretty cool. Don't know why, it just seems a bit small here. Maybe because that's just the picture, but still, it looks pretty cool. Oh, okay, that's better. That's better. The size looks way better. I have to give this literally a 9.7 out of 10. This chariot looks, it looks cool. Okay, next we have some, okay. We got the, um, what's it called? The FX. No, I don't think it's the FX. VFX. For, I don't know what VFX stands for, but this is the VFX for Mori's triple kick, I think. I have no idea. Mori has loads of different kicks. Because he does re Taekwondo. But, anyways. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, damn. They even did the animation for it. Damn. That, oh, that animation looks clean. Let's let's, let's replay that. Oh, oh. Oh, that animation looks clean, okay. That's a solid 8 out of 10, to be honest. Like, that animation is clean. Even the Smackdown. Oh, combo. That, that's a combo right there. Next, we got... Um, Dar Darway, Darwees. I can't say his name. Okay, go go get mad in the comment section that I can't say any of these names. But Da Darwees, Darway, Darwee. He's he he's actually my favorite character in God of High School. Like, I really like Mori, but I prefer Webtoon Mori than um, Anime Mori because Anime Mori he was just they didn't make him look as cool as he did in the Webtoon. But I I really like Darwee. Like. His character and everything about him. He's just he's he's a cool, he's a cool like like to save like he went into the tournament to wish to save his friend. That's a pretty cool thing. Even though he ended up beating up Mira, but yeah, we don't talk about that. Yeah, we don't talk about that. But anyways, we've got the Megalodon Chariot. I don't know who has that. That's probably the guy, the the blue haired villain. Um the weird guy that no one cares about. What's his name? I can't remember his name, but it's probably that guy's chariot when he started eating everyone with it. But yeah, I, I have to give this, because this chariot looks sick, so I'm going to have to give this a solid 9 out of 10 again. And I'll give this an 8 out of 10 because I don't really see anything interesting about a shark, but it's still cool. Hayate's bubble, it, that looks really clean as well. I'll give that an 8 out of 10. Jin Mori's face, the face looks cool. Whoever made this face is definitely talented. Like even the shading and everything. And they got the art style down with the nose. I'll give that a solid 8 out of 10 again. Now what's this one? Oh, it's just the combat. Oh! Oh, that double kick. Oh, boom, boom. Oh, okay, that double kick. Let's replay that. Damn, that double kick is... Yeah. Boom. Boom. Oh, that double kick is sick. Street for street fighting style, damn. Okay, we got a Joker card. Oh yeah, let me break that. I give that seven out of ten. That's pretty solid. Um, Joker card. Joker card looks cool. Okay, that that looks cool. I'll give I'll give that an eight out of ten. Okay, even in game it looks cool. The Joker chariot revamp. Oh, okay, I can definitely tell the hands were changed. But yeah, that, the Joker chariot looks even cleaner. Like, before I give this an 8, I'm gonna give this an 8.5 now. 
because it looks even cleaner. Um, just because everyone says the joke is too small, that is very big, okay? That chariot looks clean. Um, you Mirror Sword remake, that looks clean again. But I kind of preferred the old version because it had like the rope with the thing attached to it, but it is what it is. Um, I'll give this a solid, I don't know, I just don't like it that much. I'll give it a solid 7.5. Nine tails Fox, bro, we still got a long way to go till we get to the bottom of these things. So let's start speeding up before the video is like 10 minutes. We've got Nine tails Fox, um, Ill Pose, Illy Pose, I don't know how to say it. But this is a pretty solid uh, model. I have to give this a solid 8.5 out, 8 out of 10. Now here we get to the cool chariots. Like, look, this is the, what's the Black Judges chariot. One with the white hair, like, look how clean this looks, like, bruh. Imagine, imagine how big this chariot would be in game, like, it looks so clean, like, you'd be nasty if you had this chariot, honestly. Dragon chariot, this, this is the chariot I'd go for, to be honest. I don't know what the best chariot in game would be, but still, I'm not really caught up with the webtoon, but still, this chariot looking fire, honestly. So I have to give this honestly a 9.5 out of 10 because that is fire. Um, this game we're looking at, this definitely doesn't look like Roblox, like the quality is so fire. Um, we also got the mage, mage looks fire as well, probably, that's probably enough for Chariot, maybe not. Oh, even though the animations for the Joker, I'd give this an 8 out of 10, but yeah, the, the animations for the Joker, and the Joker looks pretty cool, like even the idol animations, like, I'll both give both of these 8.5 out of 10. But that is, that is facts. The main city map, even the map looks clean. Like, look at this. Oh, the map does, the map looks clean, bro. They need to add more life to the map, but then, other than that, the map looks clean. Ayate with the bubbles. True, yep, the bubbles do look good. Bro, what is that noise? Wait, I'll be back. Okay, so here's the main city map. Um, I'll give these all of these a solid 8 out of 10. Like, everything here is from 7 to 8. Like, 7 and above, okay? All the rankings, like, no, there's nothing below 7 here. And all the sneaks they post are, like, really solid. So I recommend go join Mezumi Studios. Like, shout out to Kumo, shout out to Mezumi for for you know just making a solid game. I've been in this server like for a very long time. Like, I've been in the server since it started, so it's pretty cool to see see the game grow even more. You see, you see. Oh my God, Jesus, bro, a man's got thirty six YouTubers. Oh, I've never seen so many YouTubers in one game. But still, okay. So yeah, here we go. The combo, the combo combat starting animation. This looks pretty sick. So I better give that a seven out of ten. Like um, all of that looks really sick. Project Chariot, another new logo. Yeah, this looks pretty cool as well. I have to give that logo. They didn't need to put the black marks in there. No one's gonna take their time to crop all of that out just so they can steal it. But still, Project Chariot. Um, solid, pretty solid sneak. I give that um, eight, uh, nine out of ten. Like that's really, really good for a logo, especially the way like they did the crown. It looks really, really cool. Next we got Jin Mori without his mode. I don't know why Jin Jin Mori just seems so just looks pale. Like, bro, I, I've seen some pale white people, but bro, like, yeah, it's not, I don't, I don't have anything against white people. It's just, just the, Jin Mori is quite pale. Um, what else we have? We have his crown thing, and his mode is Monkey King mode. Like you'd think the Monkey King would be black, but nah, nah, it's it's Jin Mori. But anyways, I swear his headband thing is blue, but still, it doesn't really matter. Okay, so now here we've got hand diary, hand hands. <sighs> now here we've got hand diaries. <sighs> Now here we've got Hand Diary Sage Mode. Oh my god. Now here we've got Hand Diary Sage Mode. 
the one I've, I have no idea where the sage mode is from but it's probably from the webtoon it's probably I, don't, I, don't, I have no idea but the, the mode looks pretty pretty cool like this model looks really really saucy like I have to give this a solid 9 out of 10 again because man this model is saucy okay I have no idea what this is in the background but still the model looks really saucy so I'm gonna give that a 9 out of 10 honestly that looks real saucy anyways my favorite judge judge Q um, his model looks saucy as well I, I don't know this is something weird maybe it's just because you can't he has, you, his face is not there but still but yeah judge Q my favorite judge I'll give that oh what should I give that I'd give that a solid 8 out of 10 now here we've got God's Blade, the, the one that the guy used to attack um, Jin Mori's grandfather. This model looks really cool as well. Like look at that, oh the effects on that. I have to give this a solid 9.5 out of 10. Okay, now we're getting on to some of the cooler sneaks and we're nearly at the bottom. Yeah, we're nearly at the bottom. So here we've got Force Hammer. Now the Force Hammer looks really, really cool. Like. The actual hammer bit looks really really cool but it was, they should just upgrade the handle like this would have been a solid 9.5 but you know no not 9.5 but if the handle was cool i would have gave it a 9 but for now i'm gonna give it an 8 just because the handle's kind of plain like they're like they started working real hard with the top and then they just ran out of time and they popped up popped on the cylinder but still either way it's pretty pretty cool Next we got Jack the Ripper. Is this is probably another chariot from the show? Pretty cool chariot. Like, you know, this this video time is getting quite long, but still, we, we're gonna finish off with the last few sneaks. We're gonna finish this off quite quickly. We got Jack the Ripper. This is a, probably a solid like eight out of ten sneak. Like, it looks real cool. I'm gonna give that a like. Then we got Jagil Tech, the most the the most boring villain in all of anime like in the webtoon i don't know how good he is because i haven't finished it but he is a pretty bad villain in the anime like he, he kills like some random people takes their legs or something i don't really care overall he has no solid backstory but yeah this is his form after absorbing the key and the form does look kind of saucy so i'd give that a solid like 8 out of 10 Next we got another Jagil Tech sneak where he was before he even ate the key. I'll give that, did I say 8 out of 10? I think I did. But yeah, this is Jagil Tech. His, the blue hair looks real cool in this lighting. And yeah, this looks like a solid low poly. Um, what's it called? I don't, I don't know why it reminds me of low poly, but it's a, it's a low poly, you know, model. Um, looked quite solid, I'll give that an 8 out of 10. Oh yeah, here's Judge S. He's one of the judges I don't really care about, but his chariot, if this is his, if this is his chariot, it does look kind of saucy, not going to lie. Um, that's a solid sneak, so I'll give that an 8 out of 10 as well. And here we're on the last sneak, mirrors, mirrors, yi, yi, pong, bong, sion. That, that was hard to say, but still, this is mirrors, chariot, um, I don't know if that's her chariot or if she's combined with it but her chariot does still look cool nevertheless that's all the sneaks from project chariot i'd give that a solid 9.5 because that looks real saucy i do sound quite tired but it's wrong it's because i've done all of this okay these are a bunch of sneaks okay so yeah it's, it's, it's just it's just boosting equals tester five invites equal tester Am I a tester? Let me check. 